All right, this is an image, okay, that was taken at Ocean City. And there's really nothing wrong with it, okay, except for I would like to take this kid and I would like to move him somewhere else along this line. All right. And I probably want to take out that sign too. So um, let's take out the sign first. Let's, we're going to take this image because you can't do this in Lightroom. I'm going to take this image, okay, into Photoshop. All right. And this is my layers panel, panel here. This is my tool panel. The layers panel just has a background. It's just a background image here. There's nothing, no other layers and things. And um, just real quick, okay, what we can do is take out that sign. And the way to do that, we can do it a couple ways. We can just clone it out with the regular clone. Or uh, probably the easier way, okay, is remember, just take the lasso tool. Since we're gonna use content aware in this video, and just circle it. And then we're gonna come over here to edit. We're gonna say fill, all right. And when you get this dialog box, it has foreground color, which is the black. It has the background color, which is the white. It has other choices too, but we want content aware. That means it's going to take a the computer, okay, is going to take into account all the tones in this image and it's going to, or that's surrounding this sign, it's going to fill them in itself. So we say, okay, and it's gone. And what do you do about the marching ants? You just go up to select and say deselect, and it's gone. Now you could have done that too, okay, just with the regular, just, just with the clone tool, all right, where you could just clone it away. Um, all right, let's look at this now, okay? We want to move this element in the photograph. We're going to move it somewhere along here, but we can't put it anywhere because, well, let me show you. All right, we're going to take and use what's called content aware move tool. All right, and again, all you do is circle your subject. And you look, you have to look inside now of the, of the dotted lines of marching ants and see the tones. These tones, if we try to move this, it's not going to work up there because the tones of the background, okay, won't mix with the tones of, of, of what's around the, the kid. So we have to find a place along here where we think, okay, that it'll work. That looks pretty good to me. When you let go, okay, you get a box around your subject. All right. And just to show you, we don't necessarily have to do it, but if you grab one of these corners, you can enlarge your subject. You can shrink your subject. You can rotate your subject, all right? But when you're done, where you got it, where you decided, okay, where you want to put it, you just hit the check mark up here at the top and the computer does its content aware. Look at that. I think that's a pretty good match. And to get rid of the marching ants, you just go to select, deselect. That's how you can use, okay, content aware, okay, to, to move an element in a picture. 